Hi, my name is Paul Boyle, and I'm from Fishers, Indiana, which is located around 30 minutes north of Indianapolis. I have lived in Indiana my whole life and plan on living here as long as possible and hopefully raising a family here in the future. I am a human resources management major at Ball State and I have a minor in business administration. My sister is two years younger than me and is pursuing a nursing degree at Ball State as well. My dad John is from Fort Wayne and has five siblings while my mom is from Cincinnati, Ohio and has no siblings. My dad's side of the family is Irish and French while my mom's side of the family is German and Mexican. The object I chose to share today is my grandfather's sawmill sign and his name is Bob Gross. Uh, this is uh, the sign that my mom's father had above his own private sawmill. He was a very handy man and lived on a farm with my grandmother out in the country. He worked his own private sawmill and I find this very important because both me and my family wouldn't be here without the hard work and dedication that my grandfather put into raising my mom and working on the farm in his sawmill. My family, both on my mom's side and my dad's side, are very hard workers, but I chose to choose this sign because it really is a perfect symbol that represents my family's hardworking spirit. Uh, the item is important to me because it really makes me appreciate where I came from and what it took to get me to where I am today. And the fact that my grandfather was an entrepreneur and ran his own business, even though his sawmill wasn't the largest or the most successful, I find myself very proud to say that I'm his grandson and that he ran his own business where he was really the only real employee that worked at the sawmill. Uh, I only have... Uh, some brief memories of my grandfather since he passed away when I was four but some of those memories were riding around on the tractors or watching him saw pieces of wood in his sawmill and his spirit will live on through myself and my family in future generations. Currently my grandfather's sawmill sign is in my basement with several other objects that my family holds dear to them and right now my parents plan on giving it to either my sister or myself and after that I hopefully will hold on to it until I grow old and choose to pass it down to another generation of my family so hopefully that will become a tradition and will keep the spirit of my grandfather as well as remind the rest of my family how important it is to work hard and what it took to get them to where they are now. Thank you.